Hello, my dears. I am a singing psychic and welcome again to my Sunday show where I kick off with the song of the week, the very song that you need to hear in your heart all week to help you find joy in the week ahead. Now, this week's song, you're going to recognize it by these lyrics. Yellow man in Timbuktu. Slam it to the left if you're having a good time. Shake it to the right if you know that you feel fine. Yes, it is, of course, Spice Up Your Life by the Spice Girls. Now, why is this the song for you for the week ahead? A few reasons. One is, it's very inclusive. You know, these important lyrics that they sing about, Yellow Man in Timbuktu, Kung Fu Fighting, Dancing Queen, Tribal Spaceman, and all that's in between. We are all that that's in between. We are fabulous and So many of us are still in lockdown, partial lockdown, or still going, what on earth was 2020? So we have to find a way to spice up your life. Now, what spices up my life is different from what spices up your life. But I suggest you get a pen and paper and write down three ways to spice up your life between now and the end of the year. What would spice up your life? Do you want to learn to play an instrument? Do you want to go and have some wild sex with someone you've been thinking about? What do you want to do to spice up your life? I encourage you to do it wisely and safely. If necessary, cover yourself in plastic because we all know what the crazy is with lockdown now. But yes, so before I play this fabulous tune, and if you're listening to this on my uh, via the Instagram or the Facebook, you won't hear the tune. You will have to go actually to my proper podcast. But what else am I going to look at this week? Well, interestingly, Spice Up Your Life is one of the big songs around when Marcus Rashford was born, the English footballer and, of course, activist who has been fighting f- to help child poverty and ensure children in poor situation have free school meals and have food. Incredible human, so young, just 22 years of age and has doing so much. But before we get into him, let's look at one of the songs that was really a big song around when he was born. And I want you to get your armpit chakras in the air, open your arms, dance around in the kitchen, wherever you are. And all week, whatever happens, even if it's hard, just get up and do a shaky, 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 spice up your life. You can't help but love this tune, okay? So with the very feeling of slamming it to the left and shaking it to the right, I want you to imbue that fantastic Spice Girl song in your life every day this week. When you get up in the morning, do a little shimmy. And at lunchtime, every time you, every time you go to a toilet, just go on, give it, give it that shimmy. Remember, spice up your life is the point of this week. In a safe way, obviously. Now, I am the singing psychic. And I walk through a world of music. As many of you know who have come to see my shows across the world. And one of the ways I can also guide people is by looking at the songs around when they were born. Very important part, because the songs that you heard when you were in your mother's womb say so much about the problems you have and also are a kind of fortune, four, as in number four tunes, in your life ahead. So this week, I want you to have a look at Marcus Rashford. Now, for you, if you don't know who this is, if you're outside UK, he is a British footballer and also he plays for Manchester United, he plays for England. Marcus Rashford not only is a fantastic footballer, but he has also been fighting for the last two years about childhood hunger in the UK. When he was a child himself, he had free school meals because in UK, if you're parents are on benefits, the children get free school meals and holidays. It is something he is passionate about. He has been working on this since last year. And of course, now in COVID, he has repeatedly taken on the Tory government and keeps on winning about making them change their mind to ensure that children are not left hungry and are even now going to be fed because of him constantly fighting. So I really wanted to have a look at the songs around when he was born to see if we could yet again see the the, the start of such a fabulous human being. Now, obviously, the fact he is a fantastic footballer does not just mean he was born with it. There's huge amounts of work. And again, though, he could have chosen to sit in the privilege of who he is. But no, he has kept coming out and saying, no, I had free school meals. Let us all support the world. 
Let me look at the songs around when Marcus Rashford was born. We of course have Spice Up Your Life. We know he spices up everyone's life. He really has gratitude for his life. And has a and he's particularly when the, when the Spice Girls talk about the salsa and the rumba and the dancing queen and all those kind of dances in hip hop even, I think maybe it was a predictor of how he is on the football field. He's very fast on his feet. He can do some very clever things, very fast and very rhythmic. Rhythm is in his soul. And you can see that from Spice Girls song. Another big tune around when he was born is Puff Daddy. Faith Evans, I'll Be Missing You, which of course uses the bass line and the main tune of the police, Every Breath You Take. The important thing for me in this is Every step I take, every move I make. Marcus Rashford is so clear about the fact that he has worked very hard to get where he is and struggled and fought. But also he's aware people will watch every step he makes and every move he makes. But he understands where he comes from. The original Puff Daddy and Faith Evans, of course, also centers around the death, the murder of Notorious B.I.G. and how they'll be missing him. But I so understand that Marcus Rashford understands where he's come from and he's not going to just fight for himself and his family, but for the wider world. Incredible human. Other big tune around when Marcus Rashford was born was Chemical Brothers back with block rocking beats because it is this idea he's kept on going. He really has been playing football since he was five. He joined Manuel when he was seven. He just keeps coming back and back, getting better, getting stronger. And we can all learn from that. Let's keep on practicing and getting better in our life. Okay. And then, and even with the Tory government, he lost, then he kept on protesting, he won. Always he comes back. Amazing. And then the last tune, I'm going to play all of these, is the fabulous Men in Black by Will Smith. There are some lyrics here that just are so Marcus Rashford. We're the first, the last, and the only line of defence. He really has been like, no, I know the UK government don't want to feed these people, these children over Christmas, So I am going to be their last line of defense. I'm going to keep on fighting. So don't forget, as Will Smith sings, the good guys dress in black, remember that. And if I turn up in your hood, it's because I'm there to to defend you. And actually, I think Marcus Rashford, this is a start of a very long, interesting career. So let me play the three tunes. I hope you're inspired, but, but have a dance around and don't forget, spice up your life. So if you would like to book me, The Singing Psychic, to do a customized special event where I look at the songs in you and all your friends' hearts, maybe we can play some of my Singing Psychic game show games from Psychic Bingo to Psychic Jenga. We can do it all online or off. Just let me know. I have worked across the world and for many cool, cool things, as you know. So find me. I'm on at Marisha T on Instagram and Twitter. You can find me on The Singing Psychic on YouTube. I'll be back next week, of course, with some more tunes for your Sunday chill up session. Have a fantastic week and don't forget, spice up your life. David Zenia, I am The Singing Psychic.